Hey everyone, this is Shooting Illustrated bringing you another episode of iCarry. In today's feature, we're taking a look at the Davidson's exclusive Glock G19X 9mm pistol and some related gear. Let's take a closer look at this kit. While the Glock G19 has been covered numerous times here on iCarry, the G19X has only made one other appearance. Coming into existence as part of the U.S. Army's modular handgun solicitation, the G19X appeared to be the reverse of what concealed carriers and Glock fans have been clamoring for. Rather than having the shortened grip of the G19 and the longer slide of the G17, the G19X has the G17's grip and the G19 slide. Think of it as the commander version of the Glock handgun. The version of the G19X we have in today's kit is a Davidson's exclusive, the G19X MOS threaded barrel. While the longer slide of the G17 and shorter grip of the G19 would make for an easier to conceal handgun, since the longer slide sits below the belt line, the configuration of the G19X is equally workable. The full size grip allows even the largest of hands to get a full firing grip on the pistol, and magazine capacity increases by two rounds. With the threaded barrel, the G19X is slightly less than 8 inches in overall length, 5.5 inches tall, slightly more than an inch wide, and weighs 22 ounces unloaded. This is not an overly large pistol to conceal. Up top, the slide is cut for Glock's proprietary MOS optics mounting system, which uses a series of plates for dedicated optic footprints to attach various electro optics. The system allows for a wide number of optics to be attached to the pistol, but with two caveats. First, there is more complexity in that two screws are needed to secure the plate to the slide, and an additional two screws secure the optic to the plate. This means double the normal number of screws to keep track of in the mounting process. Second, because of the need for a plate, optics sit slightly higher on the slide. One workaround for this is a purpose-built optic like the SCS MOS from Holosun that is designed to bolt directly to the MOS optics cut itself. One major advantage of the G19X is that, after all, it's based on the Glock handgun itself. A world of aftermarket holsters, magazines, and upgraded components is available to the end user, whether to complete your EDC setup, make your Glock even better, or simply to make it your own. The Davidson's G19X MOS threaded barrel offers optics mounting capability along with taller front and rear sights, as well as the threaded barrel if a suppressor is desired. Add to it, change it up, or simply order more magazines and some holsters and you're ready to go. Because the threaded barrel requires either a G17 size holster or an open mouth design, we've opted for Mission First Tactical's ambidextrous AIWB OWB holster to go with the Davidson's G19X MOS threaded barrel pistol. The open muzzle will accept Glock handguns of both compact and full size frames, as well as combinations thereof like the G19X and G45. Constructed of Bolteron, a thermoplastic favored for resistance to heat and warping, the ambidextrous AIWB OWB is a durable option. The ambidextrous AIWB OWB holster is, as the name implies, easily converted between left and right handed orientation by simply swapping the hardware from one side to the other. The belt clip location can be changed based on the user's need for either inside or outside the waistband carry. Cant and retention are adjustable, there's an extra tall channel for suppressorized sights, and a single belt clip for 1.5 inch belts is included. Rounding out today's kit is the Buck Knives Mini Deploy Automatic Knife. With a 1 and 7 8 inch long S35VN steel drop point blade that opens with the push of a button, the Mini Deploy is quite useful for everyday tasks. Aluminum scales with a black Cerakote finish offer a durable surface that is also available in gray and bronze. A removable pocket clip is attached at the very end of the handle, allowing the Mini Deploy to ride low in the pocket to be unobtrusive. With the automatic opening of the blade, and subsequent push-button release of the blade to close using the same button, the Mini Deploy is simple to use with one hand, regardless of handedness. Should a degree of personalization be desired, Buck offers up to two lines of engraving on the blade for a modest surcharge. Having a reliable, easy-to-use option is always a good thing, and it can be even better with a personal touch. For more information on the items we've chosen for today's kit, and for other guns and gear combinations, please visit shootingillustrated.com. And, as always, stay tuned for more episodes of iCarry.